Hello guys, welcome back. Um, today I'm gonna show you how to make this manipulation. I call I call it emotional witch manipulation. So yeah, this is gonna be the end results, and let's begin. So I'm gonna bring the woman. No, not the woman. I'm, I'm gonna bring this background. And I'm gonna bring the other background, these clouds right here. I'm gonna press right click and flip in vertical. Change the blend mode to soft light. Now we're gonna add a brightness and contrast on brightness we're gonna put minus 45 now let's bring the the woman uh, right click to flip horizontal and let's um, resize it like mm, like this click okay now we're gonna add a hue and saturation but just to the woman so let's um, click and hold press and hold alt and let's click between these two layers so now we're gonna go right here and we're gonna choose red and we're gonna put minus 45. Now we're gonna go to yellows and minus 28. So now we're gonna out of some color color balance go to this um, adjustment icon and choose color balance now we're gonna choose shadows and we're gonna put minus 20 4 and 0 and on midtones we're going to put minus 12 13 and 0 and on highlights minus 19 2 and 0 but we want all these uh, adjustments just to the woman so uh, let's press and hold alt and click between these two layers there you go so now let's bring let's add a gradient map let's change the, the blend mode to overlay and the opacity 80 and fill 80 and we're gonna put this gradient right here I already have the gradient map um, ready but if you wanna use well these gradient maps these two one these two is gonna be on the description so you can download it so yeah just use this one right here and click OK and we want this gradient map on the woman only so press alt and click between these two layers Let's add another gradient map. So, um, gradient map. Let's change the blend mode to soft light, opacity 50, and fill 50. And we're gonna choose the second one. Click OK. And let's. Um, Put this as a flipping mask by pressing Alt and clicking between the two layers. So 
So, so now we're gonna make a new layer below this um, woman layer. So click the woman layer, uh, press and hold control, control key and click on new layer icon to make the new layer below that layer. So let's name this um, white. Now we're gonna select the brush tool soft soft brush 100% and like the size just make it like like mine right here something like that not too big not too small and brush just on the edges so once you brush the edges go to filter blur gaussian blur and uh, let's put on radius about 200 and the blend mode to soft light so the difference between this white and without the white uh, is this so now let's um, Press control key and make a new layer and click on the new layer icon to make a new a new layer below the white layer and let's name this stars. So we're going to add some stars to the background. Choose the brush tool and I already have some stars brush brushes. So I'm going to put the link in the description for you to download it. I'm going to choose this one, 919. And uh, I'm going to make some adjustments to it. Just like that. And I'm just going to click and brush to make the... to make those stars I'm gonna put the opacity around 50 so now let's click on the top layer and let's add some brightness and contrast and let's put minus 10 on brightness so now click on the woman layer press Control key, add a new layer, name this layer moon. Now go to the brush tool, select the moon brush. I'm gonna select to this one 750. I'm gonna resize that moon. something like that I'm gonna select the soft brush I'm gonna add a um, layer mask to the moon layer and I'm gonna delete the hard edges like that Now go on top, on the top layer, and let's add a hue saturation adjustment. On the saturation, let's put minus 15. Now let's add a new layer. And let's choose the brush tool. Something this big. And just make some, let's change the color first. And the color is going to be... DDF5FA so it's kind of white and light blue <coughs> and brush just lines from the moon from the moon to the face go to filter blur Gaussian blur and put this around 100 
click OK, change the blend mode to soft light and the opacity around 70. Now we're gonna make a new layer because we're, we're gonna add some a sphere right here on the hand on the hands so add a new layer name these um, a sphere then go to the brush tool and select this bubble brush if you don't know how if you don't have this bubble brush and you don't know how to do it check out my last tutorial and you're gonna find out how to make that bubble brush so size about 500 and brush with white change the color to white and brush right here now select the soft brush add a mask layer to that layer to the sphere layer and we're going to delete this this part So now it looks like the sphere is on the hands of the woman. Double click the sphere layer and we're gonna click on outer glow. And the color is gonna be 95F9FF. Click OK. the blend mode to screen opacity 70 spread 1 and size 150 yeah let's put 125 and click ok so now we're gonna make a new layer and with the soft brush now let's go to the color picker to the eyedropper to select the color and let's choose click inside this um, the sphere on this blue color to select that color and now we'll go to the brush tool on this new layer uh, we can name it um, uh, light reflection uh, now nah, just leave it name it like uh, now nah, leave it like that we, we're not gonna make any more layers so just leave it like that and with a brush to just brush this part of the face so that's gonna be like the reflection of the uh, sphere light so brush this change that to soft light the opacity around 50 so that's with the reflection light and that's without it now we're gonna merge all these layers into one layer so press and hold control shift alt so now we have all these layers into one and go to filter lens correction custom and on binget put minus 20 click ok
and that's it guys i hope you like it this is the end result so yeah if you like this tutorial hit like comment if you have any questions share this tutorial or this video with your friends and most important subscribe for more for more videos in the future so thank you guys and see you all next time